I'll send it. I'll send it again. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Mhm. Mm Where did my oh. mouse go? Uh oh. There we go. Dang it! You beat me to the punch. <laughs> anyway, here we go. But last night was different. Actually, he is what made it different. Yes, he was kind of small. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is it the one with Ron or Rufus? I don't remember. <laughs> yeah. It's a little Rufus. Okay. Just for time out, I wonder if they have like a. I should make my own fan fiction of this. You know what I should do? Well, have Cody, we're already writing Ron it together. No, have Ron Stoppable screwing Shigo, but taking a glass tube and shoving Rufus up her butt. <laughs> <laughs> like Ron. Who do you think Shigo is? Richard Gere? <laughs> 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 oh no, um, yeah. me and Cody are actually writing a fan fiction right before we started this episode. It was basically oh, based on the last Chibi Fangirl episode. Uh, We're not episode. done with it, but we want to read it later, so. Okay, okay, but somehow you looked past that just long enough to give him a chance. He knew, or could guess, most of the name of this and he didn't care this wasn't about impressing or competing with any one of your past or future for him the only thing that matters was making you feel good right <laughs> this was so new for you that you almost didn't know how to handle him. Do you want to add the jazz music to go with it? Because I sure, will. I guess. <laughs> I don't care. Just, just let me continue reading this crap. <laughs> I don't know what my child is getting so raped right now. Oh, trust me, we haven't even gotten to the good stuff yet. was pleasuring you. Fast, <laughs> slow, tender, rough. Okay, what the fuck are you Fiction before sending it to the chat. I just know they're okay. awful. <laughs> From the description. Give him a, okay. Sorry about that. Now she go give him a proper good morning. You lean over and kiss him on the nose. He smiles. You smile back and ask him, Still a penny for your butts? He gets a buffled look in his eyes, looks up. 
smiles brightly. And then in a happy and voice, hey, <laughs> Okay, and that gives you this little bit of thing. Hate me, please. I hate myself for posting it. Then why did you post it in the first place? <gasps> oh, it? God, I hate those people. Those are the worst people on fanfiction.net. Okay, let me give you the rundown of fanfiction.net for those who don't know. There are the crapheads who are 8 years old, who think they're like 21. There's the 21 year old crapheads who think they're 8. And there's me, who's the most mature person on do and on fanfiction.net. There's some good writers, but then again, they end up ruining it later on. And then there's the people who write good fanfiction and start hating it. And then there's the crap heads who write bad fanfiction and hate it anyway. Uh, I'm just going to call them crackheads, because that could be an insult to crackheads. <laughs> I said crap. I said crap heads with a P. I just cracked to come up with this crap. <laughs> I would say the other word, but again, there could be someone listening in the other room. So, yeah, thank goodness so wait, it's, it's, it's over? It's over? Wait, so is that fanfiction over? Okay, yes it is. That was the worst fanfiction, well, the worst oh sex fanfiction I've ever read. I'm sorry. You get an F. <laughs> Go home, fanfiction writer, you're drunk. Back to my WRMC days. Okay, anyone want to read the next one? Um, well, what's the, the next one. Oh, God, I, I think I'll bite the bullet for this one. All right, the next one's the Mailbox and Steve fanfiction from Blue's Clues. Dude, I hate Steve from Blue's Clues. I love Steve. Wait, wait, he's not the guy who left, right? Yeah, that's the guy with the green yeah, shirt. The guy who left. Oh, I like him. I hate the other guy. Yeah, I hate the other guy too. So this guy, this story is about Mailbox and Steve getting it on. <laughs> what? Yeah, it exists. And it's funny because because in episode zero, it's funny. It's funny because in episode zero, me, Gus, and Cody made this joke. It's like, oh, what if there was a fan fiction of Steven Mailbox? I'm like, oh, it doesn't exist. A few days later, it exists. Somebody. I think Gus wrote this. I, I yeah, I think Gus wrote it too. I mean, he, he wrote I, it because I told I, him to. And anyone want to read this? Because I really had uh, took the bullet for you guys. And you post it in the chat. I'll take it for you. All right. So I'll I'll send it to you. Okay. All right. I think we should all, all right. take turns so, reading this. But I think I'll. Take I'll the this one. All right. I think we should all take turns. Actually. Because, um, yeah, I think I should go last because I'm going to burst out laughing at every sentence. If I, I might start sounding like Kevin Lamar for this one. You might hear a lot of gahee. <laughs> What's that? This one is long. What, the Steve fan fiction I just sent? Yeah. I didn't read it. It, it was pretty short in my book because I skimmed through it. No, nah, it's kind of long. Okay. Mm. Ah, ah. I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, it always takes forever for like a. Yeah. Post it's only two thousand words. That's pretty short in fan fiction terms. Oh, there we there we go. It's loading. Yeah. All right. He got his. I'll get mine by Chase and Jasper. <laughs> Not to mention jackass. <laughs> Thank you. This show's the show's canceled. Whatever will Steve in the mailbox do without Blue's Clues? Hot one shot. Don't read it. I'm easily offended. Couldn't find the Blue's Clues category. Hope you can find this. Um, I'm he already did offended. He did it. Uh, this could offend anybody. English makes friendship. Two thousand three hundred four words. One fave. Who the hell fave this? Some drunken idiot. Go home, Good. favor. You are Wait. drunk. All right, that is complete. It says we couldn't take any more. <laughs> Disclaimer, I don't own Blue's Clues. I just do fucked up things with the characters. <laughs> no kidding. This <laughs> <laughs> <is> so wrong. Why <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny? I not read it yet. All right, I'm going to tell you exactly what went down. Exactly. You've heard the stories, the rumors, all wrong. All completely wrong. So I'm going to tell you what's right. See, it's high noon, and the neighborhood is bathed in the golden light of the angels. It's 2009. And Blue's Clues has been off the air for quite a long time.